Nicholas this season, her look is really bold. And so for the men, we slicked the hair back and we made it really greasy and shiny. And for the women, we did a really strong wig with a strong line and then asymmetrical with a really high fringe. It's just cool. It's edgy, it's strong, it's beautiful. I think it's modern. It's even like forward thinking. I collaborated with Nicholas. We wanted to take something traditional and then clip it on its head. And so we took a traditional cat eye, smoked it out a little bit, but only did from the bottom and winged it out that way and really focused on the lower lash and keeping everything else really minimalistic, modern, and cool. I was inspired by a book by Jean Gaumi, which he portrayed deep sea fishermen, the struggles that they have to deal with and human against nature and so that was inspiring for us because we're also avid fisher men. And so we took elements of that world and translated it into the silhouettes, the boots, the oversized anoraks. A lot of different combinations. Like we did cable sweaters mixed with denim and leather. And then we have different prints, like a water print in burgundy and our Atlantic colorway. And wool is always a big component of the collection, so we use a lot of merinos. And that's incorporated in the sweaters, cardigans, and then also in some of the headwear. I wear a lot of Nicholas K. They make clothes that are just different from everything else. I feel like it's different without being so outrageous or out there. I wear skinny jeans all the time, and I got an email from them saying, we named the pair of pants after you, and I was like, oh, sure you did, and next thing I know, I got them sent to me, and it had the tag that said West Pants, so that's awesome. The clothes look urban and earthy. They Usually the, the colors of the clothes are usually like an earth tone. There's always a sporty, outdoors element. I think they do a really good job of making clothes that go well together. The women's clothes have a masculine feel and the men's clothes, not that they have a feminine feel, but they're very sort of like unisex. I could see either men or women wearing the, the coats or the pants or the boots. So they do a really good job of making something that's sort of unisex, but doesn't really feel overly masculine or overly feminine. They do a really good job of that. We're pretty minimalistic. I think our girls are pretty androgynous only because they're on the more natural side. That's kind of inherent in our sort of design and like who we design for. I mean, we base it on our own lifestyle. So it has this sort of feel of being minimal, functional, and also uh, stylish.